At five, consumer and business spending spurred economic growth at the end of 2023, but the U.S. Treasury Secretary says it is still just too hard to be a working parent in America. Today, she outlined ways she hopes federal economic policy can help, but millions of Americans are looking for relief right now. Ron Jones has a closer look for us tonight. Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen in Chicago Thursday, addressing a topic that hits home for millions of Americans. It's still too hard to be a working parent. The speech, an effort to highlight administration economic policy as President Joe Biden campaigns for a second term. But polls show American voters are skeptical about Biden's handling of the economy despite cooling inflation and a resilient job market. Families in particular feeling the pressures of a challenging housing market and child care cost that have increased with demand and shorter post-pandemic supply. Child care is exceedingly expensive right now in this country, and that makes it difficult for families to work. Wendy Edelberg of the Brookings Institution says the child care system suffers from underinvestment, from training to retaining workers. There's a lot of turnover in the system. It is difficult for a child care facility to maintain stable, high quality child care in the face of all of these pressures. Meanwhile, a tight housing market continues to vex home buyers, but especially families. Edelberg says relief is less about the strength of the economy and more about the policies within it. There's a lot that we should be doing to make it easier both to work and to raise children and to make it more worthwhile to work. The Commerce Department said Thursday that consumers continued to spend in the last three months of 2023 with economic growth rising at an annualized rate of 3.3%. Meanwhile, most parents expect to pay for their children until they become adults, but the payments don't always stop the second they turn 18. A report released today by the Pew Research Center found parental financial obligations are stretching longer than they used to. Many parents say they are helping their now adult children into their late 20s and early 30s with things like food and shelter as more adult kids carry more student loan debt than their parents did.